As part of Comenge's design initiative in the Tangara project, a full-size mock-up was constructed to provide information on car layout and access and to permit three-dimensional evaluation of aesthetic standards and human factors. The mock-up was also used to compare passenger flows to evaluate the ease and speed of entry and exit under a wide range of conditions. 170 volunteers from two Sydney churches participated in 74 tests, each test simulating the use of half a full-size car. The first series of tests were based on the layout of an existing suburban car, repeating the design of the upper and lower saloons, vestibule, doorway, stairs and stanchion positions. In all the tests, a video camera was positioned outside the car above the doorway and was used to record and measure the entry and exit times. The sliding doors were manually operated and a wide platform provided ample space for passengers to congregate on entry or disperse on exit. Another camera inside the car above the vestibule recorded the movement of passengers in and out of the vehicle and up and down the stairs. This camera clearly highlighted the bottleneck caused by the single width stairways of the existing design, as well as some drawbacks in the vestibule size and layout. The mock-up was modified to represent the proposed Tangara layout with its larger vestibule and wider doorways. The series of tests with the larger vestibule and doorway demonstrated an initial improvement in passenger entry and exit times. But the determining factor in station dwell time was still the internal stairway design. The inside camera clearly showed that once the vestibule was empty, the wide doorway was of little value, as only a single file of passengers could negotiate the narrow stairs. The outside view shows that only two passengers at a time exit the car, despite the wide doorway. The third series of tests were of the longer car, with a large vestibule and double width stairways of a more gradual inclination. Several variations to the stanchion positions were also investigated. It was observed that passengers entered the long car faster and with a more even flow. With fewer cars in a train and less doorways, the total number of passengers had to be increased from 140 to 170. Nevertheless, the entry and exit times were considerably less than the original car for a crush load. The inside camera showed that passengers consistently used the stairways two abreast, and this accounted for the increased speed with which the car loaded and unloaded. The open layout of the vestibule area also gave passengers a much clearer view of the main saloons, and this appeared to speed up their decision to move into the body of the car to find a seat. Test number 50 shows very dramatically the movement out of the long car of a crush load of 170 passengers. The steady flow is clearly facilitated by the double width stairways. Several tests were conducted to show the flow into the long car of 85 passengers while another 85 were getting out. The doorway and vestibule design enabled passengers to pass one another without undue congestion or obstruction. Inside, passengers were able to pass one another on the wide stairs, thus considerably reducing the station dwell time.
the test showed that the Tangara design, as well as the long car design, were both faster in loading and unloading compared to the existing cars. The long car design was in itself superior to the Tangara design, not just in respect to the station dwell time, but also due to the ease with which the stairs could be negotiated and the sense of spaciousness conveyed by vestibule and stairway design. Comments from volunteer participants reflected these conclusions. Easier to get in and out. Able to move faster up and down the stairs. People can go up and down the stairs at the same time. Feels roomier, more aesthetically appealing. Not as claustrophobic. Stairs not as steep. Less pushing and shoving, not as congested. The whole carriage is exposed, gives a sense of security. The long car with its wide stairways and open spacious vestibules is a significant advance in suburban vehicle design. The incorporation of these concepts in the Tangara project will greatly enhance the SRA's reputation for innovative design second to none in the world today.